Good afternoon. Today is Monday, June 3rd, and we're going to be going through the latest market update for Silicon Valley, Santa Clara County. And the city that we're going to do a deep dive in today is Sunnyvale. All right, I hope everyone's having an awesome Monday. Let's start with Santa Clara County. Let me share my screen here. Okay. First, with the, the one, two, three, four, five. The five stats we're going to be looking at are number of active homes for sale, number of pending homes for sale, months of inventory, median price, and days on market, which is the length of time the house is on the market before they accept an offer. So let's look at the active inventory, number of homes available for sale for Santa Clara County. We're going back to 2021. We can see that we have a definite increase in inventory, but we're below our peak here of July, 2022. Right, so the actual numbers, we're looking at 1,112 homes for sale versus there was 1,200 um, in May. And we can see here the really low inventory at the beginning of the year kind of tells a story of how tough it was. We've almost, we've, we've more than doubled the amount of inventory since we had had since January. Right, so let's see number of pendings. So can we, we can see that we're definitely on the uptick right from the beginning of the year, which was much slower because there was less homes available for sale. So we're just under a thousand, which again, we're below what we were in 2022 and 2021 for number of pendings, right? So 2021, there was a lot more homes went pending. And so now let's look at months of inventory. So we've had very low inventory for quite some time now. So we have just over a month of inventory and you can see that we're below what we were in 2022 in the beginning of the year, right? At only 1.2 months of inventory. So it's still very much a seller's market. So let's look at the median sales price for Santa Clara County. So that number has definitely increased. Um, the access here is go starting from zero, doesn't really show the picture. Um, if we look at the actual numbers, you can kind of see that we've crossed $2 million for the median sales price, which is quite an increase, right? So um, looking back, in 2021, the median sales price was 1.65, right? So we've we've crossed over $2 million, right? Which is quite quite the increase, right? And that, that will show in the days on market as well. So let's see here, right? So single days, single digit number of days on market. So Right now we're at eight, it, things are moving extremely fast. Um, I think pricing strategy is, is, is very, very important. We'll discuss that at the end once we finish up with Sunnyvale. So in short, for Santa Clara County, um, the market, we've had a little bit more inventory now, um, as you can see, but uh, prices have um, increased quite, quite a bit. So let's look at Sunnyvale. Let's start over with number of actives for sale. So we can see here, yep, we're on the increase, right? But we're still below the peak of uh, last year of 2022. So number is 47 homes for sale. We're below, below um, last year and the year before. So 66 and 52 homes for sale. Let's look at number of pendings. We can see that 
we're a little bit below of last year, right? So kind of steady here. Similar numbers if you go looking at um, May of 21 to 23 and May of 2024. Pretty, pretty steady here, 74, a little bit below 2021. All right, so let's look at how much months of inventory we have. All right, taking a little second here to refresh. Okay, if that doesn't work, okay, there we go, months of inventory. So we're less than a month. So it's uh, very much as still, and has been for quite some time, um, a seller's market in Sunnyvale, quite a desirable area, um, bordering, Sunnyvale bordering, um, Los Altos on the west side, Cupertino on the south side, and Santa Clara on the east side. If you can look at a map after this, you can kind of orient yourself with um, where Sunnyvale is in Santa Clara County. So now let's look at the median sales price. So we've crossed over 2.5 million for Sunnyvale. So we're at 2.6, and you can see here it, about $500,000 increase from 2021, right? So median sales price in Sunnyvale for 20, May 2021 was $2,085,000. Now we're at 2.6, right? So starting from the beginning of the year, median sales price of 2.37. Now we're at 2.6. So quite an increase. And I think days on market will be quite low, it's very it's very similar to the overall county numbers of single digit days on market. So eight days median um, before, a median of eight days from when the seller puts the house on the market to when they accept an offer. So things are moving um, quite fast. So there was a, a brief uh, blip here in uh, 2022 where it was quite high, but it's been quite steady. You can see back to 2021 being um, under 10 days. So now let's take a quick look at the map so we can kind of see where uh, Sunnyvale is. In case those of you that are not um, as familiar with all the cities here in Silicon Valley, Santa Clara County. So here we go. So Sunnyvale right here is oh, outlined in red here. So we have Los Altos down here, Mountain down here. Then this is Mountain View, where uh, Google is Google headquarters about right there. Santa Clara is right here. NVIDIA headquarters are just right here. Cupertino is south of Sunnyvale with um, the Apple headquarters about right here. Sunnyvale is very, very centrally located in Silicon Valley with uh, Google and Facebook on one side, NVIDIA on the other, and then uh, Apple just below. And uh, in Sunnyvale headquarters of uh, LinkedIn are, are there actually, for those that want some trivia. Okay, so that kind of summarizes the June 2024 market update for Silicon Valley, Santa Clara County. We did a deep dive into Sunnyvale. Things are still selling quite fast with prices quite high. I'd say um, my market sentiment is that uh, we have a little bit more inventory right now. So there's a little bit more choices for buyers. I think it's still a strong seller's market. And uh, if you have any specific cities or questions about stats, feel free to reach out and uh, hope everyone has an awesome day. Thank you.